Hey, Conan O'Brien here. You know, behind every great NCAA basketball team is an iconic mascot that whips the crowd into a frenzy. Michigan State Spartan, the Florida Gator, the Kentucky Wildcat. But there's one mascot I thought needed a little help. Actually, a lot of help. UC Irvine's Peter the Anteater. I visited the school to see what I could do. Well, this is nice. I'm here with Helen and Maria. Thanks for meeting with me here. Yeah, thanks for coming. Yeah, a lot of women become suspicious when I ask them, <laughs> can you meet me alone in a gymnasium? Yeah. They don't, uh, they don't show. So you have chosen the animal that's pretty much blind and sucks ants using its two foot long tongue through its long nose. That's the animal that best represents UC Irvine? Yeah. You're allowed to say, like. you're allowed to say no. Would you ladies be open to possibly seeing some improvements for Peter the Anteater that I thought of? Sure. Yeah. As you know, the Anteater uh, is an animal with very poor eyesight, so I thought this might reflect a more honest version of Peter Aww. the Anteater. No. no. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Is it going to be possible for me to meet Peter now? I'd like to meet him and speak to him. Uh, we, we can make that happen. We Are can there, make that work. Wow, yeah. okay. It's like he's the Dalai Lama or something. Okay. This is exciting, the moment we've all been waiting for. Here he is, Peter the Anteater! Yeah! Do you speak? You don't, no, no speaking. Okay, you don't speak. How do you pump up the crowd? Okay, all right. That looks like you've caught fire and you're trying to pull it out moment before you're tackled by a fireman. Would it be possible to talk to the man inside the costume? Is that something that's possible? I will blur your features and we will distort your voice and that way no one will ever know who the real you is because that's, Something I want to respect. Is that cool? You seem like a really good guy. What year are you? I'm a second year. Second year. Okay. <laughs> Soft I can yeah. hold it back in mind. Are you in good shape? Can you? Oh, yeah. I do for sure. <laughs> See, I go much further down than you because of the nose. Now, have you ever thought, okay, don't get crazy. Don't. Stop it. You're dressed as an anteater. <laughs> okay, we've now been joined by Sam. Sam assists you, is that correct? He helps correct. you come up with the moves. Now, Sam, um, we're not going to hide your identity. There's no reason to, but we are going to distort your voice just because it's fun. You cool with that? Fun. All right. Maybe the anteater's holding you back. That's why I brought some materials that I would like to pitch you. Okay, guys? I just went to the costume department. Mm. This is a licensed Conan O'Brien head. Look at that, and look at his face. Expression. That same face next to him? Sure, oh yeah. <laughs> you wanna try some moves, some Conan moves? Pull the string, pull the string, then a third time, and then cut it, and then drop the hip. Yeah, well you cut it with the other hand. The hand that's holding the string can't also cut it. <laughs> Don't you think we need to take it to the next level? I'm open to suggestions. Thank you, here we go. In the entire game of basketball, of college basketball, you're the one mascot that comes out and you prepare tableside guacamole for people in the stands. You can have the cone and head free this one time, no charge, and then put together this crap and make a body and then try some of my moves and we see how it goes. Please welcome the UC Irvine Chicken Bengal Cone and Head! Yeah! I also uh, found this trident at the last second. So yeah, you're also like ruler of the sea. You're a little threatened, right? Because look at this guy. This guy's got energy. This guy's got probably the gene for alcoholism. <laughs> yeah! Chicken,
coming with the tiger. Gooey guacamole, tiger chicken coming with the tiger. Gooey guacamole, tiger. Not my best idea.